What's up everyone? I'm back. Haven't uploaded in a while. I'm um, not going to make any excuses. I just, to be honest, I have not been asked or had the energy to do it. Um, simple as that. I haven't had any time. and I've had nothing to upload either. So I don't want to put crap content out. I want to try and make it as good as possible. So that means taking the month out until I've got something worth uploading. And I'll do that. In this one, I've been trying to do this video for ages. And I've, uh, I finally feel like I've got enough from them to really do a proper brand spotlight. Because it's one of my favourite brands at the minute. It's called Violent Rose. Um, I follow them through Instagram. They're an English company, so they make everything in the UK. It's so good, the quality is lovely, the denim, interesting designs as well. So I'm not going to babble on. I've got a discount code, which they've hooked me up with. Um, it's JTW for 10% off. I'll link that in the description. Have a look at some of the stuff. They've got a big sale on at the minute. The discount applies to sale items as well, so you get double hit. We're getting straight into it. I'm going to start with the denim that they do, and I'm going to work through, because I've got about six pieces that are from them. So let's go. The first one, these just arrived the other day. These are on sale. But when the first came out, I wanted them anyway, so that was the double double look. But it's a denim, it's a sand wash denim. We've got a lovely little violet rose detail on here. That's a nice little soft leather, really nice, proper leather as well. No pleather. Go to the middle. You've got like the sand washed on here. Awesome. And that's on the back of him. That's not on the side or the front or anything, that's on the back of the leg, so that's an interesting choice. Most of them go on the inside or outside leg, this one's on the back, so that's quite a cool little touch. I'll have on-body on, I'll have on looks of all these later on in the video, so if you want to skip to that, I'll uh, time link it in the bottom as well. You've got a little bit of detail on here, um, don't know how keen I am on it, but it doesn't put me off, it's just sort of there. But really, really nice, you've got the sand washed and the contrast and sandy stitching on that as well. Really, really nice quality, nice and soft. Part of the native collection this one so you see that's what it is there on the back I'm gonna make this as quick as possible so we'll get on to the next one the next piece is actually a hat and um, it's like a suede hat it's not the best quality and um, i thought it was gonna be a little bit thicker before i ordered it but i got this for 17 pounds should have been 25 i think it was and um, i think this is part of the same native collection it's quite a tall cap um i don't know i'm sort of undecided whether i like it or not i quite like it when you wear it backwards like so, get these tucked in, I don't know, I quite like it like that, backwards, but it depends on what you wear it with, I guess, but, you know, £17 is still quite a nice hat, and with it being the suede, beige kind of colour, it gives it a bit more of a different different feel to any other hat I've got, so I thought, well, I might as well buy it, but, uh, no, quite cool, that's got the bike rose banding on there as well, but moving on. This is the second pair of denim I've bought from them, this is like the black stone washed one, these zips are on the inside. Not on the back of the leg, these are on the outside leg um, on your ankle. You've got zips on the front pockets as well, so that's the back of them. The button back pockets. There's no drop crotch, although they do kind of look like they might do. You've got the zip on the pockets here. Just a lot of little details going on. You've got another little button on here. As well as the Violent Rose stud pin just here. I hope that focuses on it, just there. But really nice. They're quite a heavy stone wash, but they look really nice with like a white shirt or all black. Really nice. And there's plenty of pockets to put some shit in. Another one down there. But nice. Once again, quality is really nice and soft. Moving on, we have these. This one was actually uh, incorrect order. I ordered a different one, but they'd run out. And they sent me this one instead. And I, I could have sent it back, but I actually quite liked it. And this one was double the money. And they gave me it for the same price. So I kept that definitely. Once again, really soft. I actually saw Ronaldo the footballer had this on his Instagram. Nothing to do with why I bought it or anything, but after it came, I just happened to notice it because they tagged him in um, one of their photos and, you know, he had the same thing. So, although it's only a small brand, there's some still big names that's wearing the stuff. So, it's getting out there. It's becoming quite a big company. So, stay tuned for some big stuff happening with them. But I'm, I'm a big I'm a big supporter. The quality is really nice and I like to support British brands as well. So that's that one. The next one, I don't wear as much as I used to, but uh, I still quite like it. It's a long line, quite a baggy fit, khaki colour, and you also have this little uh, cross-section weave down here with the metal bottoms on. Just gives it a different feel. I think you've seen me wear this in the past on some of my channels, but it's quite nice. It gives it like a nice little stack layer, and you can layer with it really well. Once again, you've got the Violet Rose branding on here, and you've got the stitching going down the back just there. On the final piece, which is a denim jacket, which I need to customise because I feel like it's just perfect for that. But I'll show you it now. So that's it there. Violent Rose denim jacket. 
really heavily distressed. You've got distress going all on the back. It's black, heavily, wa heavily, heavily washed black with a violent rose on here. You've got button pockets, buttons all have the violent rose detail on. It's just a really heavily distressed jacket, but I want to put like a lot of badges on the arms and things like that, but keep them with the black, black finish. So like maybe one, one rolling stones, mouth, tongue, whatever, it, you know, the logo is called on there. And then the rest of it just like black and gray badges. Cause I think that'll look really cool. It's like a statement jacket, but that's it there. I hope you like this video. I've kind of tried to keep it a little bit short, but I still, it's a brand I really, really like. And I want to share it with you because they do some really good stuff. They do ship overseas, but there there is a premium. It's about fifteen dollars, I would imagine it would be to ship over into America or vice versa into Europe, things like that. But really good brand. I definitely recommend you try them. Have a look at least. I'll link them in the description. And if you want to buy anything, use code JTW for ten percent off. Hope you liked it. Subscribe to the channel. You know if you want to see more from me, and it helps motivate me to do more videos as well. When I see people subscribing, really brightens my day. I've got email alerts on, so it gets, I get told when someone subscribes and it just puts a big smile on my face. But like it and share it as well if you want to help me out. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Also, I forgot about one piece. I bought this ages ago. It was the first piece I bought from them. It's a, it's a really bold piece, let's just say that. Um, it's, a, it's a massive sort of quilted cowl, they call it. Um, basically, it's a massive cardigan with a really baggy hood. Really, it actually looks really nice under a jacket, like a big bulky jacket in the winter. It's just warm as can be, and that stacks loads on here. I won't put this on at the end of the video, just because it's boiling outside at the minute. Um, and I have worn this in previous videos, if I'm right. Um, if I can find an old clip, I'll put it in. If I can't, then it is on one of my earlier videos. I did wear this. I think it might be OOTD2 or something like that, um, if you want to look at my channel. But it, it's really quite an interesting piece, I think. I saw it on their Instagram and thought, you know what, I, I kind of need that. So, uh, yeah, I just thought I'd show you that before I forgot. I remembered after I'd uh, filmed it, that was in my wardrobe. Sort of in the, in the winter side. I'm in summer mode at the minute. Uh, and it's the t-shirt. You're lucky I'm actually wearing a top, to be honest. But in, on, the, on, on body stuff. <laughs>